And a good morning to you. You know, we're here in Kenner this morning at the AP Clay Center, and there's folks already working on the building out here. But this area was not the only area around us that was said, look at what happened in St. Bernard Parish as another. I mean, this, this tornadic activity just sweeps through the area. And the next thing you know, you've got trees being snapped. You've got chimneys being popped off. Uh, and things that you used to have, well, you walk outside and they are simply gone. Residents in St. Bernard Parish spent a lot of yesterday walking around just trying to find the possessions they had that was they were blown away. So the gazebo is usually on the cement. It went over the railing and the sunshade top of it's in the pool. And the worst to my house is just the fence down over here and that's it on our house. And then everything on the back patio is kind of blown around. And so really in this little break between the weather we've had already and the weather that's coming this afternoon, there'll be more damage assessment that's being done. People are going to have to go out and see what kind of damage they sustained and see what needs to be done, almost get in line, if you will, uh, to get some of that work taken care of. It'll be some long days. Guys, back to you. You know, Heath, based on all that damage, what is the pressure to get that cleanup work done? Oh, you know, there's some, there's some urgency here. There's some pressure here. You know, certainly a lot of damage from the Texas uh, border all the way across South Louisiana. But think about this. We're just a couple of weeks, less than that, away from hurricane season. All the work like here has to get done before hurricane season because if another storm comes, that's unprotected. So there's, there's a sense of urgency, if you will, for people to figure out what they need to do, get it finished before something else happens. Guys, back to you.